Have you heard about the contest? We've been running this for, for 11 years and we've had some real big entries. It's winner take all, yeah. bragging rights and so much more. We announce a winner and they get a trophy. So you're probably asking, what do I have to do to win? Sign me up. Find the, the largest cat face spider that anyone can bring in. Wait, seriously, find the biggest spider? Okay, I'm out. We had this contest with cat face spiders because they're one of the largest ones and one of the odder looking ones. This year's winning spider shattered the competition. Weighing in at nearly four ounces, Princess Rhea was 25% bigger than any other spider ever entered into Whitney Cranshaw's competition through CSU. She was named after the person who found her. This was, it was a class by itself and it came from from a nine-year-old. Yup, a nine-year-old girl from Lamar to took it upon herself to get out into her backyard and catch the state's biggest cat face spider. You win, Rhea Davis Thompson. I'll let you have this one. She smashed the contest. Colorado has some pretty spooky spiders. So this is the uh, bug zoo. From tarantulas you can see down south to western widows that can bite. But cat face spiders are the biggest you'll see yeah. making a web outside your house. This year, we had the biggest ever by far. Even with its newfound glory as a record holder. All time state champ. Not sure if costume stores will be selling out of cat face spider onesies anytime soon. A weird looking spider. In Fort Collins, I'm Mark Salinger, 9 News.